Hey, what's up guys? It's Flex and welcome back. As you guys know, for the past two years, I've been driving around the bends with the stock 18 inch AMG wheels and they look okay, but after everything I've done to this car, I definitely need to upgrade the wheels. So today I wanna show you the brand new wheels I installed on my 2016 Mercedes-Benz C300. I'm not gonna keep you guys waiting, check it out. So here are my brand new AMG E63 style wheels. So these are all 19 by eight and a half with a five by 112 bolt pattern and with an aggressive 35 millimeter offset. And these look awesome. So as you can see, the satin black spokes and it also has this kind of aluminum um, ring around the edge. That's actually pretty cool. And for the tires, I bought 235, 35, 19s all around for a square setup. And I also went ahead and bought some brand new wheel caps. These gloss black Mercedes wheel caps, they just look super sharp and they were actually really affordable. I also went ahead and bought all brand new wheel sensors. This is just to make sure that, you know, I don't have any warning lights or issues with the car. Um, and everything's good to go. And of course, because they are a nice satin black and they're brand new, I also protected the wheels. So I protected them using ceramic coat. This is Rim Q2, it's really affordable. I've used it on my Audi R8 wheels and they work awesome. Really easy to apply, so just thoroughly wash the wheel. And then once it's fully dry, I went ahead and grabbed the microfiber towel with some isopropyl alcohol. Thoroughly wipe down the wheel so it removes any dust, dirt, debris. And after it's fully wiped, even inside the barrel, once it's dry, I just go ahead, dabble on some of the ceramic coat onto the application pad and just start wiping everywhere that I want the wheel to be protected, including the inside barrel. And then after about a minute, I go back and then I use a microfiber towel to buff off all the excess. And once the wheel is fully buffed, I just let it sit for about 24 hours to cure, and then I can go ahead and start handling the wheels. Pretty nice, right? So I only paid maybe a third or a quarter of what the actual OEM AMG wheels would cost. And I got those wheels from my buddy Chad over at Rim RS. And his company stocks tons and tons of different wheels. If you want Mercedes style wheels, BMW style wheels, they have almost everything. So I'll go ahead and leave Chad's information in the description below. You can call him, you can text him. He's super responsive and very helpful. And of course, mention Flex for a discount. Installation was pretty easy. I started off by breaking the lug bolts loose. Then I proceeded to jack up the front of the car. Next, I grabbed my impact gun and removed all the lug bolts. And then I was able to pop the wheel right off. Before I put on the new wheel, I'm gonna do something about the caliper. About two years ago, I did a video where I installed a carbon fiber caliper cover and I also installed a white caliper cover and I asked you guys which one I should keep. So now I can finally install the white one because the new wheels will clear it. So it's really easy to install. I'm just gonna slide on the top and bottom brackets as you can see here. And then I'm gonna install the included nut on the top and bottom and torque them down to spec. And once that's nice and secured, I can go ahead and install the wheel. So there are the wheels, guys. What do you think? I think they look awesome, especially with all the other black accents I've done to the car. And that kind of lip, 
that really like kind of gives you the size of the wheel yeah i know i need to lower the car but i don't know if i'm going to do that yet but with the white caliper cover the black wheels that looks really good and look at the stance so 35 millimeter offset it's pretty much flush so that's a front and that's the back yeah it looks pretty good I mean I don't really have to play with spacers or anything and I don't have to worry about the wheels hitting the lip on the wheel well either Well, there you have it. The wheels look awesome. Well, I think they're awesome looking. I haven't had any issues with them whatsoever. I hit a few bumps and also a few potholes in New England where I live because the roads are really crappy and the wheels held up fine. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, hit like below. As always, make sure you subscribe and I will see you next time.